So Huawei came up with a new fitness tracker, and that's the Huawei Band 8. This one has a rather big 1.47 inch outer touch display, a very strong battery life, and you get customized watch faces. So today we will check out the top five reasons why the Huawei Band is a must have smart band in 2023. All right, let's start with some of the specs and the design. So right here we have a rather large fitness tracker with a 1.47 inch outer touch display with a resolution of 194 by 369 pixel. Although we have a big fitness tracker, it is still pretty light with just 14 grams without the strap. You really don't feel this one during the day, night or during your workouts. The Huawei Band 8 is a square watch with curvy edges and the black bezels around the display aren't even that chunky. On the side of the watch, we get one physical button that takes us to the app menu and back and we have a silicon strap with the quick release feature. Now the Huawei Band 8 is available in a few different colors. You can either get this all black version, but there's also a pink, green and orange version that you can get. As for last, this one is water resistant up to 5 ATM and it is compatible with iOS and Android smartphones. So next up, the battery life. Now this fitness tracker can live up to 14 days, but that's without the sleep, SP2 and stress tracking. With all of those features enabled, the battery life will drop down to 9 days, which is still great. The last level is the always in display mode. So if you toggle this feature on, the battery life will drop down to just 3 days on normal usage. The activity tracking on the Huawei Band 8 is pretty much normal. You get a few sport modes, which cover all of the normal leads like running, walking, swimming, cycling, and a few more. Plus the device automatically recognizes some of your activities such as rocking and running. What I also really like about this fitness tracker is that we have a built-in GPS that we rarely see in fitness trackers. Next to those things, it keeps track of your daily steps and your active minutes. One of the coolest features that you will find on the Huawei Band 8 are the customizable watch faces. So first up, you do get quite a few watch faces by default, which are even a little bit customizable. You can change one or two displayed metrics. And when we head over into the Huawei Health app and click on watch faces, you see that we have lots of them. Like always, there are a few that you can pay for if you want something fancy, but there are a bunch of watch faces that are for free. Downloading and installing them is a matter of seconds and you will find analog watch faces, digital ones, cute panda and kitten watch faces, and some that are just packed with metrics. Like with almost every smartwatch, you receive all of your notifications on this watch life from WhatsApp, your emails, and you get missed call notifications as well. Something that I also really like about the auto display and the watch faces is that you can interact with your application from your watch face. Just click on any metric and it will lead you right to the application. Like this, you don't even have to look for it anymore. You get a music player with which you can skip a track, you can go back a track, play and pause and adjust the volume, and some standards like alarm, timers, a stopwatch, a weather app, and a flashlight that's not all that bright, but still nice to have. The health metrics are a little bit more interesting than the rest of the features. Even though we have a rather cheap smartwatch that you can already get for about 60 years over here in Germany, you have quite a few health metrics. We got the 24-7 heart rate tracker that will alert you when you have a very high or very low heart rate. The sleep tracker that actually didn't work during my nights and only tracked my naps, so I can recommend this one. You get a stress tracker and breathing exercises and the SPO2 tracker that either tracks on demand or during the night. So quite a lot that you get for that price. Now guys, I've also covered the Huawei Band 7 and other fitness trackers in separate videos. Now just click that video right here to get to know more about them. And I guess with that one being said, I will see you in the next one. Peace.